Hi guys, it's David at Humble Tracker Channel. How are you doing today? Get ready for the humble review of 2018. What I've got for you guys is a review of 2018. I'm gonna pick out some highlights, my favorite gear, put them in categories, and I've also got a couple of uh, social media shout outs, and there's also gonna be one small bonus review. So you know what's gonna come up, I've got the following categories. I've got Craftsman of the Year, Folding Knife of the Year, Fixed Blade of the Year, Piece of Kit of the Year, Tool of the Year. And then I've got, moving into the social media category, I'm gonna give, give some shout outs. I've got a Lifetime Achievement Award for YouTube, and I've got a Newcomer on Instagram Award. And then somewhere through that list, I'm also gonna fit in a review. So let's get into it. Craftsman of the Year goes to Peter Zarbo, the Slovakian master of hand forging taken out here one of his examples this is my absolutely adored Viking tomahawk with carving in the blade all hand forged oak handles carved there so you can use it as a close-up tool somebody's already felled this pine let's just give it a bit of work Peter gets this award because he's just a master of his craft. I'll put his link to his website where you can check him out. He does big axes, tomahawks, knives, uh, flint, fire strikers. He doesn't copy anybody. He's completely original. Completely original, you know, master of his trade. So an easy award. Craftsman of the Year, Peter Zarbo for his hand forging. Next up, Folder of the Year. This was another really obvious winner in this category, and that goes to the Ganzo FH11. Came in late, it was the last knife I reviewed this year, or the last folding knife I reviewed this, this year, but it was a clear hands down winner on a number of counts. It's got an excellent, smooth, slick flipper action. It's got great design. It's in the D2 steel, and it's a venture out for Ganzo because they're designing their own knife really not copying anybody else which is great to see so they're putting their high quality of manufacture their low prices and now making their own design a real easy choice the Ganzo FH11 fixed blade of the year that was a little bit more of a tricky decision to make because uh, I've looked at a lot of uh, high-end knives custom knives and also down at the budget range but what I've actually decided to go for is an everyman knife, so a budget knife. It goes to around the 30 to 40 dollars range, and it was also my favourite knife of 2017. So this is a two-year winner, and that's going to be the HX Rock Survival knife. I've gone for an everyman knife because it's a little bit more accessible than the higher-end knives I uh, I review. But it's regardless of that, it's just a fantastic all-round survival bushcraft hunting knife. It comes in a great kydex like sheath it's got the built-in uh, sharpening stone on it it's tough as nails it looks good it's just an overall great winner two times winner the hx rock piece of kit of the year goes to fishing wolf hobo reels and their handmade in the uk hobo reels hobo reels quick intro what they are it's a little piece of equipment that you can throw in your backpack or in your pocket take anywhere so you can fish whenever the opportunity arises it's made out of hardwood, I believe. It's hollow, so you put all your equipment inside. It's a bung, fits tightly there. This is the Gen 2 model, so it's got the bow curved handle there. It's got the beveled spool end, so when you cast it out, it swings out nice and smooth and goes a good long distance. It comes with a good uh, amount of line already on it. It's got the O-ring, so you can attach your line under that so it doesn't get all tangled up in your pack. Great couple of guys making these in the Midlands in the UK. Link to them will be on the screen in the description box. Very nice price between 20 and 30 pounds, I believe, last time I looked. Support these guys, they're a startup industry. Support your local uh, companies. The guys from Fishing Wolf Hobo Reels, great guys, great kit. Here comes the bonus mini review, and it's for this. The Keith Titanium 220 milliliter camp mug. Made out of titanium 
with folding handles. Bit of a funny story about this. I ordered this off the net if you uh, from Gearbest. You see my old videos, I've got a titanium kit which was sent to me from a great friend in Tennessee. Uh, thanks Mark, loving it. Love you too mate. Uh, anyway, I wanted to uh, add to that kit with a titanium mug. So I ordered this off the net and then it arrived and I thought what they've sent me. A bleeding egg cup, it's tiny. But nevertheless, it is titanium, it is a mug. And I learnt a lesson. Always look at the actual uh, volume of stuff before you order it off the net and don't just look at the picture. This is 220 millilitres. I thought I was going to get a proper full-size mug. I'm using it anyway. For tool of the year, I'm ramping up the financial scale. We're going higher up the ladder. This isn't a budget tool. This isn't an every, ma every man's bit of kit. This is an expensive piece of kit, really, for, but for what it is, okay. it's well worth the money. And that's a TS Prof sharpening system. If you want a great edge first time, every time on your uh, edged tools, if you want a repeatable process, high engineering, the TS Prof is the tool for you. It's definitely the tool that I've found is the best for me. TS Prof, a Russian company, they're great guys there. They always give me good support over the email and on the Facebook Messenger whenever I've got questions, inquiries about how I sharpen certain knives, what technique I should be using on their, on their tools. They always give me great service. So thanks comrades, divide the vie, tool of the year, the TS Prof sharpening system. That's the end of the gear awards for 2018. I'm gonna go into the social media section of this now. And my first award is for a lifetime achievement on YouTube. And I'm giving it, give it to the the ultimate legend of YouTube hunting. The warrior, huntsman, poet, renaissance man. Every man, Greek hero. It's got to go to Derek at Tex Grebner Outdoors. This man deserves his prize on so many different levels. Firstly, he has probably the best hunting channel on YouTube. Text Grebner Outdoors. Click that link after you watch that video and go and check him out. Not only that, he is one of the most well-read, intelligent people I've ever come across in any walk of life, let alone on the internet. And thirdly, he has transformed himself physically. He won't mind me saying, I'm sure, that he used to be well out of shape. He used to be a lard ass. <clears throat> but for the last couple of years, he's trimmed himself down and now he is super fit. He's an inspiration to me and he should be an inspiration to multitudes of people out there. So Derek, you get the Lifetime Achievement Award for being the ultimate YouTube Huntsman, poet, warrior, legend. Next award goes to newcomer on Instagram of 2018. And this goes to Dev at Valley Gunsmithing. And he's got a second Instagram account called Opium Go Bushcraft. He also have a, has a website where he sells uh, the gear and so on and so forth. He's based in Canada and he puts up great pictures, great content, great engagement on Instagram. He's a fantastic guy, and I've got to say thanks, Dev. Dev actually showed me how Instagram works and how I could actually use Instagram. You know, you know, I'm an old guy. I've just about managed to work out how YouTube works. Then I wanted to go on Instagram. I wasn't getting any traction there. And Dev stepped up to the plate, and he gave me all the ins and outs of it. So thanks, Dev. He's got two great Instagram accounts. He's got his website, and I do understand when he gets around to it, he's going to be starting a YouTube channel, and I'm really looking forward to that. Cheers, Dev. Newcomer of the year on Instagram, Valley Gunsmithing and OP and Go Bushcraft. All these links will be in the description box or on the screen. Now I've got some bonus content. Uh, a little while back, I had a shout out a challenge from Woolly, at Woolly's World YouTube, YouTube channel. He's a good bloke up in Northern Ireland, and he's given me a challenge to do the Bushcraft Boogie. Now the Bushcraft Boogie is when you boogie in the bush. So here it comes, maybe there'll be some music, I can find some decent copyright free music to put in the background. Here we go. <laughs> Woolly, challenge accepted and completed. The final award, of course, goes to everybody that's clicked on one of my videos this year 
and has shown me support. Thanks guys. I hope you've had a good 2018 and any troubles you've had during this year, you've been able to push through to the other side. Have a great Christmas and for 2019, I wish you all the best and until the next time, take it easy.